Well, back in April, Andrea Moorhead introduced us to a barber on the west side of Indianapolis who provided some tips to help us get through this lockdown. Now that the lockdown has ended, he tells us business is now booming. But it's not just because people are back in his beauty shop. In fact, he told our Sarah Jones today it's because he used the quarantine as an opportunity to expand his business. After three months of quarantine here, this was one of my first calls. Brian Lomax has been cutting hair on Indy's West Side for nearly five years. During the shutdown, Prince and his dad wore a lot of hats. Others tried to DIY their hair. We had a young man take his hairline all the way back <laughs> to like the middle of his head. So when the lockdown ended, people were knocking down my door trying to get in. Made my heart smile to know that my clients stood by me with being out of the shop for three months. But those three months weren't only difficult for clients. To be told that I can't go into my own place of business took a while for me to process that. But then Brian realized he could use the time to expand his business. Just because I was unable to work in the shop doesn't mean that I stopped working on my crafts. He used the lockdown to upgrade his labeling and marketing for his master barber shave gel and antiseptic. And now, his products are being sold in several cities across the country. Atlanta, Georgia, Birmingham, Alabama, Oakland, California, and here in Indianapolis at House of Beauty and Miss Cutie in Washington Square Mall. Brian says it helped him offset the economic burden of having to close his business during the pandemic lockdown. It helped me out in my sales. I mean, since they couldn't come into the shop to spend the money on the haircut, they were able to spend money on the products. Brian says one thing he's learned as a business owner is you have to be prepared for anything and learn to adapt and turn every moment of hardship into an opportunity. What a great update. Thank you, Sarah.